lovely people welcome once again to rona 360 as usual it's about art culture and tv so over the weekend the european union visited our cherished dagon kingdom if you want to know more about it let's go Now, yesterday, the Dagbon Kingdom had a special visit from the European Union as part of the European Union's Cultural Diplomacy Initiative during the Europe Month. Yes, it was a fantastic experience that showed off the powerful music, dance, and clothing that makes Dagbon culture so special. We already know that Dagbon as a kingdom is well known for their rich music, their powerful dance, and their exquisite clothing. Now, the king of Dagom warmly welcomed the EU delegation. The people of Dagom were, were incredibly kind and friendly to everyone who visited. Dagoms are known for their kindness, they are known for their calmness, and they are known for their peace. Now, what is very interesting is that during the visit, everyone got to see and enjoy the traditional music, dancing and clothes of the Dagbon, which is of of importance to us the dagbon kingdom the king of dagbon and the people took this opportunity that if eu you are saying it is a cultural diplomacy month then the best we can offer is to show you our rich dance our best traditional music and our exquisite clothing the drums played beautiful rhythms and the dancers moved gracefully you know and usually the dance tells the stories of the people through the movement now the eu delegation was very grateful to the yana and the people of the dagbon for their hospitality the visit we know and hope helped create stronger bonds of friendship and cultural understanding between these different parts of the world, the European Union and the people of Ghana through the Dagbon Kingdom. Now, what is of interest is how the Yana sat on his skin in a very rich and exquisite smoke. You see, the colors are so beautiful. The colors are calm. The colors are unique. Now, if you notice, you realize that all the people who are seated around and in front of our king, Yana, has different colored smoke, which is unique from what the Yana is wearing. As usual, it is of custom that whatever colors that are used for your king, you who are the subject should not also use the, the same. And this was typically represented. Now, it is of importance to also bring to our attention that the EU delegation were also given very rich and colorful smokes. And the man seated in the middle, the, the fair man, is part of the delegation that went there. And you can see his smoke, beautiful colors, which tells the story of the people of Dagbong. You know, you can never go wrong with fugu material or smoke f- f- fabrics from the north. They are always on point and whoever wears it brings the warrior or the king in the person or the queen in the person. We are so excited for EU delegation as part of their cultural diplomacy month. They didn't go to any other region, but they went straight to the north. This is very important because when we promote the culture, of people in Ghana, irrespective of the region they find themselves, it helps in total to bring about cultural d- d- diversity and promotion of culture and tourism for the whole country. So we are excited about this news. We are excited and happy for the Yana. Long live the king and his people. And like I always say, if you love the arts, if you are an artist, if you love your culture as a Ghanaian, as an African, and if you cherish and love Tibet, then please stay away from harmful drugs, narcotic drugs, because drugs can destroy your life. Drugs destroy. So stay away from that. 
if you have not subscribed to the channel kindly do so because rona 360 is here to showcase and promote arts culture and tv bye bye